In this video, I'm going to be installing a micro SD card in my Motorola Android phone. Uh, my phone is a Motorola uh, Moto X4. It has 32 gigabytes of uh, storage internally, and I want to add 16 gigabytes of a micro SD card. Um, my phone is capable of doing that. It can actually store up to two terabytes um, micro SD card. And I don't need that much space, so I'll put that down. I'm going to be just putting in 16 gigs. And that'll work just fine. Uh, this is the tool that came with the phone to pop open the um, area you need to um, access. Um, to put the SD card in. These things are real small, so what I recommend is put a white piece of paper down just so you don't um, lose it anywhere in the table. And uh, the, this one is a 16 gig um, micro SD card. On Amazon, this goes for about five to six dollars. If I want, say, 128 gigs, uh, gigabytes to give me a little more storage. Um, that would run me about 19 to 20 dollars. Uh, so that's pretty cheap for the storage. Um, also, check with your if you're going to install in another type of phone or actually any phone, even if you do buy a, a Moto X, um, they might have a different version of it. Um, check and make sure what the maximum storage um, on memory um, micro SD card you could put in there for more storage. And um, all right, let's get to this. Um, put that down so I don't lose it. First thing you need to do with your phone is turn it off. Make sure it's not in standby mode. Make sure it's powered off completely. And right, shutting down. And it should buzz when it's off. There it is. Just buzzed. It's off. So, I want to take this tool here. I don't know if you can see it, but the hole is right there. I don't know if my camera's going to be able to pick that up. Anyways, if you get real good eyes, you can do this real quick. Alright, just push it in. Pops open the drawer. Uh, be careful, your SIM card is going to be in here um, where the micro SD card is going to be installed. So that's why I have this paper because the SIM card is probably going to pop out. There it is. Almost popped out. Slide that back into place. That's where you put the micro SD card in case you couldn't figure that one out. I'm sure you could. Um, I'm trying to figure out the easiest way to put this in that I found is just kind of laid on top and just slide it around until it pops in make sure everything is flush so when you go across here if you find any resistance as you're pushing it in uh, the tray pull it back out and make sure these are flush if don't try to just jam it in there you end up um could end up ruining it something you don't want to do that and just push it back in stops then turn the phone on also the um, software I use for me there's an uh, app you can use too for transferring uh, between your device and the um, micro SD card. You could download an app onto your phone and do it that way uh, if that's easier for you. For me, I use uh, Android file transfer on my computer. So I plug it into my computer and that way I can just transfer it back and forth. It's um, real easy to do. Uh, and let me get to the storage. Here's the storage now. Here's the internal memory, so that's how much I have that's used. So out of 32 gig, I don't have much left. Um, so what I want to do 
is transfer some stuff onto my SD card, micro SD card, sorry. And on this card already, I already did just a, as a, earlier I tried it, um, I transferred uh, a photo on there. Um, it's 5.1, uh, sorry, 5.87 megabytes. That's big the photo is, and I have 15.46 gigabytes free. And that's the SD card, that's the internal memory. And that's about all there is to this. Thank you for watching.